in the matchless name of Jesus. This is the day that the Lord hath made. We're going to rejoice and be glad in it. Everybody that's come on. Amen. We are praising God. Everybody that's listening on our podcast. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We are reaching. Amen. Our church. We're, com- we're reaching our community. We're reaching the world. Hallelujah. In prayer and reading and speaking on the word of God, sharing the love, the divine, unconditional love of God. That's 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 our mantra. That's amen. Hallelujah. What God has given me as a servant of Jesus Christ. Amen. He has given me the ministry of unconditional love. That's what agape is all about. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. And so we are in amen. Hallelujah. Uh, God's will when we obey the will of God, what God tells us. Amen. When we do that. Amen. Then we are in his will. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. And when we obey him and obey his word and obey the truth of God's word. Amen. We are walking in the will of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I don't know what God wants, Pastor. So many different thoughts and ideas and religions and concepts. Amen. Amen. Seek the Lord while he may be found. Call upon him while he is near. Let the wicked man forsake his way in the unrighteous man, his thoughts, and let him or her return to the Lord. Amen. We return to God. Amen. We ask for God's divine hand upon what we do. Amen. So today we're going to share with you in the word of God, a very familiar amen, chapter in scripture. Amen. Not really scripture, it's a song. Amen. Hallelujah. One of the Psalms, Psalms 34. Hallelujah. Amen. The Lord dealt with me late last night. I said, Lord, have mercy. I was fussing the day before because he didn't give it to me till later. Amen. Till about 11 o'clock. Hallelujah. So I guess, amen. Hallelujah. He's answering my petition. Okay, sir, since you want it early, here it go. Boom. Hallelujah. The best time to bless God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The best time. Hallelujah. To bless him. Amen. Hallelujah. The best time to praise him. The best time to lift him up. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. It's not when you got some money. Hallelujah. Not when he even answer your prayers. Hallelujah. Amen. The best time. Hallelujah. Amen. Is 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 when we don't know what tomorrow is going to bring. When we up against the wall. If y'all see the gentleman on his knees, almost, almost, amen. Almost done. Hallelujah. I don't, I don't, I don't just know what to do. All my options are gone. Hallelujah. But I'm just going to, no matter what, I'm going to bless you, God. Hallelujah. I'm going to magnify you with all the chaos, with all the turmoil. I'm already gone. Y'all pray for pastor. Hallelujah. All the turmoil in my life. Hallelujah. Lord. I'm not going to let you go till you bless me. Hallelujah. I'm going to hold to God's hands, his unchanging hand. I'm going to build my hope on things eternal i'm holding to god's unchanging hallelujah thank you jesus i'm holding to god's unchanging hand i'm gonna have to get a new mic this mic is acting up hallelujah amen hold to god's unchanging hand and so we hold to god's unchanging hand no matter what no matter what comes no matter what goes Amen. Hallelujah. We keep praising him. We keep lifting him up. Hallelujah. We keep magnifying the name of the Lord. So the subject today, hallelujah, is the best hallelujah time to praise God. Hallelujah. The best time to praise God and be found in the book of Psalms. Amen. 34. And it says, I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually 
be in my mouth. When we say all times, amen, hallelujah, we think it's continual. But then he said, his praise shall continually be in my mouth. So I will bless the Lord at all times on the mountain high, in the valley low. I'm going to bless God at all times when I don't know what tomorrow is going to bring, when I don't know when the finance is going to come from. I don't know where my help is going to come from. Hallelujah. Or you do know, but you got to wait. Amen. It comes on Thursday. Hallelujah. And I, by next Thursday, everything's going to be all right. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And you have to wait and you got to trust God. And he says, wait on the Lord and be of good courage. Don't make sense. How I'm going to be of good courage if I'm waiting because I'm, I'm in need of something. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And why would I be of good courage when I'm in need? I'm lacking something and I'm asking God to help me in my lack. Amen. To receive what I need for my life. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. So how in the world would I be of good courage when I'm in lack? Hallelujah. When I'm being denied something that I need for my life. It doesn't make sense. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. But I'm blessing God. I'm of good courage because of the one who I'm talking to. Hallelujah. Is it well with you, mother? Yes, it's well with me because I'm talking to the man of God. It's, I can be of good courage because I know you are Jeho Jehovah Jireh. You are my supplier. You are El Shaddai. Hallelujah. You are my God. Hallelujah, Lord God. You are Jehovah Shalom. You are the God of peace. So I can be in absolute peace even even while I'm lacking, even while I'm waiting on you, even while I'm trusting and believing on you, because it is it is you, hallelujah, that I'm waiting on. Hallelujah. It's you, the God that cares, that hears and answers prayers, that cares about what I'm going through. Hallelujah. So I can be happy. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. When I'm talking to my God, I can have peace when I'm talking to my God. I can have contentment, even though hell hounds are biting all around me even though chaos is all around me even though there's turmoil amen like a tornado of life amen is surrounding me i can have peace in the midst of the storm i can count it all joy when i fall into divers temptation for the trying of my faith worketh patience teaches me to trust in god amen to wait on him to believe in him as the scripture have said and out of my belly shall flow rivers of living water i lean and depend on jesus i'm trusting you so lord god i can bless you at all times no matter what they saying no matter what the doctor said no matter what happened hallelujah i can bless you god hallelujah i can praise hallelujah and his praise shall continually be in my mouth see the dichotomy there hallelujah amen bless the lord amen and praise shall continually amen hallelujah praise adoration exaltation hallelujah blessing amen that's in the physical realm that's the earth realm Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I'm blessing God. I'm blessing God's house. Hallelujah. Amen. I never forget. Amen. Young lady gave to the ministry. I asked, amen, for a certain amount. Amen. On the broadcast. Amen. And she called me right afterwards and said, Pastor, I'm going to give you, amen, what you asked for. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Then she began to describe her situation. I said, baby, you, you need to, amen, keep that for what you need to do. She said, no, I know how to give to to God I have an understanding as to how to give to God hallelujah amen and so we give out of our need as much as we need God is how much we bless God hallelujah he said if you acknowledge him in all your ways he shall direct your path hallelujah that's that's reciprocity it's people that understand hallelujah what giving is all about i saw amen a little clip about this amen famous preacher amen that says he's moving away from prosperity gospel hallelujah thank you jesus and moving toward evangelism that's what we all do amen we're here to share amen that's what we are supposed to do amen here to share the love of jesus christ and how he can save your soul and make you whole amen hallelujah but he said gonna stop telling people give a thousand and give 500 or give 1500 to the church amen hallelujah to the ministry hallelujah amen in the name of jesus and anybody that repents amen we are to forgive hallelujah. i'm not here to judge anybody hallelujah but we are to forgive one another and somebody see the errors of their ways amen the bible says you've been overtaken in a fault you that are spiritual restore such a one in the spirit of meekness considering thyself amen hallelujah he didn't want to change because 
because of because of man. Amen. His so-called friends. Hallelujah. But he had to do it because something on the inside. Hallelujah. Working on the outside. Amen. Oh, my God. What a change. But he said, amen. The reality of it is, amen. Prosperity is in the word of God. Hallelujah. It's not the in total word of God. Hallelujah. But it is in the word of God. And I come to let you know that it is. I would that you prosper and be in good health, even as your soul prosper. Amen. I'm not giving y'all a mind. I always tell y'all be consistent. Amen. In what you do for God. Amen. Because if you're in relationship, amen. Amen. The husband and wife, I pay the light bill. You pay the gas bill. You pay the rent. I take care of these bills. Do you, do you come into agreement. The one that don't know how to spend money correctly. Amen. Usually yields to the one. It could be male or female. Amen. Hallelujah. Usually yields to the one that can, that, that handles the money that knows how to budget. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. So, amen. They yield to that one, but I do other things. I take care of this and that. Amen. And they make, they come up with an agreement because they're in relationship with each other. Amen. Hallelujah. They might both be spenders and they're calling somebody else. They might call in an accountant. Amen. To handle their finances. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I come to let you know that we need to be in financial relationship with God. I'm not putting a number on it. I'm not saying you're going to get a new Cadillac tomorrow. I'm saying, amen, the more that you in need, amen, bless God, be consistent. I will bless the Lord at all times. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I won't disconnect, amen, my relationship and my financial, my earthly relationship with him. Finances has everything to do with that. Amen. It's not just coming to church. Hallelujah. Amen. But it's being, amen, connected to God. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I will physically. Physically, amen. Be in the Lord's presence. I will physically, hallelujah, come before his presence. I will physically, I will bless the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. If the Lord leads you uh, for a thousand or 1500, whatever it may be, a million, 1.5, whatever it may be. Hallelujah. God, amen, shall supply all your need according to his riches and glory. If the Lord say so, do it. If he don't do it, don't do it. Amen. Hallelujah. I don't care if it's a dollar and 25 cent. Give that once a month or once a week. Pastor, I'm going to give my dollar and 25 cent. That's all I have. Hallelujah to give. That's all I have left over. If you want to be consistent in that, be consistent and watch God bless you. Hallelujah. He'll bless you with five, then 10, then 20. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. But don't disconnect, amen, from God, from my relationship with him. I will bless him at all times. And his praise, I'm going to give him glory. I'm going to give him honor. I'm going to give him praise because he's worthy to be praised. My soul, the second verse says, hallelujah, shall make her boast in the Lord. The humble shall hear thereof and be glad. The arrogant, amen, will never humble themselves under the mighty hands of God. Hallelujah. Amen. But the humble shall hear thereof and be glad. Amen. And submit themselves to the will of God. Hallelujah. Thank you. Jesus. Be glad about. Amen. The Lord. Not glad about themselves. Look what I got. Look at who I am. Amen. Look what I drive. Look at the clothes I wear. Look, look at me. Look at me. Look at me. No. Now unto him who's able to keep us from falling and present us faultless before the foundation of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. He that is made us not we ourselves hallelujah hallelujah why callest thou me good oh there's only one good but the father hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah put your eyes on the lord him i will keep in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on me Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And we, we boast in the Lord and nothing else. The humble shall hear thereof and be glad because we can boast in the Lord. It's not about us. It's about Jesus. It's about God. Oh, magnify the Lord with me and let us exalt his name together. One can chase a thousand. Two can put 10,000 to flight when we come together as a people of God. Hallelujah. Lifting up the name of Jesus. He said, if I be lifted up, I'll draw all all men unto me. Hallelujah. Let's magnify the Lord. Pastor, it just seems like it's dry and dreary. It seems like we can't get a breakthrough. It seems like the whole house, amen, the devil has taken over my house. It seems like I can't get any joy. Hallelujah. The kids, nobody want to worship the Lord and pray. Hallelujah. You need to lift them up. Hallelujah. Magnify the name of the Lord. 
exalt his name make his name great in your house hallelujah walk down through your house walk through the halls praising and magnifying god hallelujah go to the kitchen hallelujah get you some oil anoint that whole house hallelujah if you're not scared call the preacher hallelujah to anoint your house and bless your house hallelujah we used to bless folks houses i don't i don't hear too much about that no more hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah but when that when that wagon get to running i'll, I'll let y'all know hallelujah when we up and running hallelujah I'll come bless your house if you want me to Hallelujah in the name of Jesus Hallelujah sanctify the house Oh magnify the Lord with me And let us exalt his name together As for me and my house We will serve the Lord Hallelujah thank you Jesus I sought the Lord the fourth verse says Amen he heard me and delivered me From all my fears Hallelujah amen faith takes over fear Where fear is there is no faith Hallelujah where faith is There is not fear God is our refuge refuse and strength hallelujah present help in the time of trouble will we not fear though the earth hallelujah be removed the counter the mountain be carried in the midst of the sea hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah i sought the lord he heard me hallelujah and delivered me from all my fears they looked upon him and were lightened amen hallelujah and their faces were not ashamed he lifts us up he's the lifter of my head hallelujah thank you jesus the, the poor man this poor man this poor woman this poor child of God cried to the Lord and the Lord heard us hallelujah and saved us out of all our troubles do you want to be delivered today how do you want to be set free from all your troubles hallelujah do you want to be delivered today I said do you want to be saved and filled with the spirit of God how do you want to be set free from everything that the devil sends at you hallelujah that's a word for Sunday hallelujah hallelujah thank you Jesus hallelujah hell proof God gave me that word this morning hallelujah amen i'm preaching that sunday morning hell proof hallelujah thank you jesus do you want to be totally delivered from the devil hallelujah amen his influence hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah hallelujah this poor man cried to the lord hallelujah i called on the lord he answered me hallelujah thank you he delivered me from all my fears i sought the lord we're not seeking god anymore amen hallelujah we, we religious leaders y'all heard the religious leader the preacher hallelujah saying that he was doing wrong for many years hey amen hallelujah preaching money hallelujah thank you jesus a lot of folk are following folk amen that's not following god hey paul said follow me as i follow christ i sought the lord you seek the lord Seek God while he may be found. Call upon him while he is near. Hallelujah. Let the wicked man forsake his way and the righteous man his thoughts. And let him return to the Lord. And say God will abundantly pardon him. Hallelujah. We need to seek God. Hallelujah. We need to seek God. God, I need to know your will, your word. Amen. Study to show thyself approved unto God. The workman need not be ashamed. Rightly dividing the word of truth. This poor man cried. The sixth verse says, and the Lord heard him and saved him out of all his troubles. The Lord, the angel of the Lord, hallelujah, that's the, that's the, that's the general, amen, the, the, the angel of the Lord, amen, hallelujah, in scripture, some believe it's Jesus and others believe it's the head of the army of heaven itself, amen, hallelujah, which might be Christ himself, I'm not going to say, amen, hallelujah, but it's the angel Lord and cast around about them that fear him and delivereth them. In other words, he's working in behalf of heaven itself, hallelujah amen the angel of the lord amen god's servant is working in your behalf hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah and if you believe him to be jesus christ himself hallelujah amen i don't have a problem with that amen because we know that he's working in our behalf he's making intercession for us amen hallelujah for satan accuses us night and day before the lord hallelujah but jesus died for everything satan is accusing him. they did this they do this look at that look at that hallelujah and jesus says look at my my blood how it covers hallelujah all sin how the scepter be the shed in the blood there's no remission of sins how what can wash away my sins nothing but the blood of jesus what can make me whole again nothing but the blood of jesus oh how precious is that flow that makes me white as snow no other fountain i know nothing hallelujah nothing hallelujah nothing hallelujah but the blood hallelujah hallelujah it soothes all doubts it calms all fears it reaches hallelujah thank you jesus to the highest mountain it flows to the lowest valley the blood that gives me strength hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah i feel like running hallelujah thank you jesus from day to day it will never lose its power hallelujah the angel of the lord god is protecting you hallelujah and not only protecting you delivering you 
How the, the best time to give him praise. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The best time to give him glory. The best time to give him on. Oh, taste and see. Hallelujah. That the Lord is good. Blessed is the man that trusteth in him. Hallelujah. We are blessed when we trust God. What you going to do? Hallelujah. You know it's due. Amen. You got to get it done by the 27th. You got to get it done by this day. You know this is coming. This bill is coming. Hallelujah. What you going to do? I'm going to trust God. Hallelujah. Amen. Your mama just passed away. Hallelujah. He did everything. Amen. You love your mother. Amen. You love your brother. You love that dear friend, loved one that passed away. What you going to do? I'm going to trust God. Hallelujah. I will trust in the Lord till I die. Oh, my Lord, I will trust in thee, O oh Lord, will I put my trust. Let me not be ashamed. Hallelujah. Thank you. What are you going to do, brothers? What are you going to do, preacher? What are you going to do, mama? You don't know where your child is. Hallelujah. Thank Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. What are you going to do, single lady? Hallelujah. What you going to do, single man? Hallelujah. I need somebody in my life. What you going to do? Hallelujah. You don't have to finance. Bills keep coming. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. How the money moving slow. How money trickling in, but the bills are flowing. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. That's why we say overflow. We sing overflow every Sunday morning. Hallelujah. We need the power of God to overflow, overtake, amen, what the enemy is doing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. What you going to do with all these things that are happening to you and all the attacks of the enemy? I'm going to trust God because blessed is the man that trusteth in him. Hallelujah. Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. And Satan is sending all those things at you that you don't see the goodness of the Lord. I would have fainted except I believe to see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Hallelujah. And so Satan comes to remove, to try to remove the blessings of the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The foundation of the Lord stand sure. Hallelujah. The blessings of the Lord is for us as God's people. Hallelujah. Amen. But we have to trust him despite what we see. Amen. Here, despite how we feel in our body, despite what they said to you. Hallelujah. Thank you. But despite the bill that's coming in the mail, we got to trust God. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. We got to bless him no matter what at all times. And his praise shall continually be in my mouth. Oh, fear the Lord, ye his saints. There is no want to them that fear him. Here we go. We keep seeing blessings coming to those that put their eyes and focus on God rather than what's coming at you. Do, do you see this being repetitive? Amen. Hallelujah. Listen to this. The angel of the Lord. Amen. No, this poor man cried. Amen. They looked at him and were like, I sought the Lord. He heard me. Amen. Once we magnify the Lord, we seek the Lord. He heard us and delivered us from all my fears. You see that concept? It is repeated again in the fifth verse. They looked to God. Amen. They were lifted. They were lightened. Amen. And their faces were not ashamed. Here come another one. Amen. This poor man cried and the Lord heard him and saved him. I wish y'all get this today. Hallelujah. And saved him out of all his troubles. Amen. Listen, here come another word of encouragement. The angel of the Lord, amen, encamped around about them that feed him and deliver them. I would that you prosper be in good health even as your soul prosper. God wants you to enjoy the benefits of this world. Not, not, not the secular sins of this world. God wants you to enjoy the divine order, amen, and the divine benefits that he has placed here. Satan wants you to worship his, amen, what's called benefits, uh, amen, a form of godliness, but denying the power thereof, amen. That's what Satan wants to set before us, amen, hallelujah, amen, sin. But God sets before us blessings. Amen. I place before you blessings and curses. Choose blessings. I place before you life and death. Choose life. Hallelujah. I place before you good and evil. Choose good. Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man that trusts in him. You're blessed when we keep our trust and believe in him. Here come another word of encouragement. Ninth verse. Oh, fear the Lord, ye his saints, for there is no want to them that fear him, reverence him, not afraid of him, that look to God for the answers. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. This is a good word right here. Hallelujah. This is a good word right here that's going to help somebody. I pray you receive this today. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, fear the Lord, ye his saints, for there is no want to them that fear him. The young lions do lack and suffer hunger, but they that seek the Lord shall not want any good thing. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Another word of encouragement, the 10th verse. 
Hallelujah. Amen. The young lions do lack and suffer hunger, but they that seek the Lord shall never want any good thing. Hallelujah. Amen. The young babies, they depend on the parents. They've been the mama. Hallelujah. To go and bring food. Amen. If she don't find no food, she can't feed her babies. Hallelujah. Thanks. They suffer, they suffer hunger. Amen. They lack because they can't go out there and get it themselves. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But they that seek the Lord shall not want any good thing. God shall supply all your need. Hallelujah. According to his riches and glory. He has everything that you need in your life. See all these words of encouragement that shows you you have it. It's yours. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And here's the invitation. Come, ye children, hearken unto me. Listen to God. And I will teach you the fear of the Lord to reverence God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. To give it to God, to trust God. Hallelujah. To walk in his statutes and his walk in his ways. What what man is that desire life and love of many days? Hallelujah, that he may see good. Keep thy tongue from evil and thy lips from speaking guile, trickery, deceit. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Man is no comparison to God. Hallelujah. You want long life. Amen. Hallelujah. You will love many days. Amen. That he may see good. Amen. That is coming around the corner. Look for good in this life. There's no good thing in this life. There's no good thing in the flesh. Hallelujah. Every good and perfect gift comes from God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Depart from evil. Hallelujah. The 14th verse says, and do good. Seek peace and chase after it. Hallelujah. Pursue it. Hallelujah. Amen. In a bad situation. Amen. You might, might be looking for peace because you are arguing. A young man said one time, are you listening or are you waiting to talk? Hallelujah. Amen. And sometimes we're waiting to talk rather than listening. Hallelujah. Depart from evil. Amen. And bickering, complaining and yelling upon. Amen. Hallelujah. Yelling at one another and tearing down one another. But seek peace. Amen. Him I will keep in perfect peace whose mind has stayed on me. And chase after that peace. Hallelujah. The eyes of the Lord are upon the righteous. His ears are open to their cry. God is waiting for you to call on him. We tried everything. You called everybody. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Called on the Lord. I called on the Lord and got an answer. God is watching you. God don't have physical eyes like we have. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So we just, they, they, I, I need to look up that word. Amen. We try to equate God with human attributes. Amen. But God is spirit and they that worship him must worship him in spirit and truth. Amen. Hallelujah. That's a word for it. When like make animals talk and stuff and they call it. Amen. Um, I can't think of the word now. Amen. And hallelujah and so amen we do it amen to make everything from our perspective instead of from his perspective but god is watching us amen he's listening to what we say hallelujah amen the face of the lord is against them that do evil hallelujah to cut off the remembrance of them from the earth in other words god is working against those that are working against him amen hallelujah though god is blessing those that bless him and focus on him and god is amen hallelujah cutting off those amen fret not that stuff because of evil doers and be not image against the workers of iniquity they should be soon amen hallelujah be cut down like grass and wither like the green herb amen we got to trust god and believe god amen put our faith in him because he's watching us the righteous cry and the lord heareth and deliver them out of all their troubles Hallelujah. The righteous cry and the Lord heareth and deliver them out of all their troubles. The Lord is nigh unto them that are broken heart and save us such as a contrite spirit. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We humbly submit ourselves to the will of God. Amen. Hallelujah. And he comes to your rescue when we're trusting in him, when we're looking to him. Amen. How when we are focused on him. Hallelujah. One of my favorite scriptures, the 19th verse says, many are the afflictions of the righteous, but the Lord delivereth him out of them all him and her are y'all included amen because all of us are righteous amen declared righteous by our belief and faith and trust in jesus christ who is god amen hallelujah so many things come amen at us but god amen delivers us out of them all no weapon that is formed against you shall prosper and every tongue that rises against you in judgment shall be condemned Amen. This is foreshadowing of our Christ and on the cross, the 21st, he keeps all his bones. Now, one of them is broken. Amen. In other words, you are intact. But for the time, for the people of this time, amen, it was for, amen, you will remain intact. 
Amen. Hallelujah. God will keep you holy. Amen. He'll keep you holy. H O L Y and W H O L Y. Amen. He'll holy keep you. Amen. But he'll keep you righteous as well. Amen. Not one of them is broken. The evil shall slay the wicked. Amen. They fight against themselves and they that hate the righteous shall be desolate. Amen. Because they're not on the God's side. They're not on the Lord's side. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. They that hate righteous shall be desolate. The Lord redeemeth the soul of his servants and none of them that trust in him shall be desolate. Amen. Hallelujah. Not, not dis dispersed or destroyed. Amen. Wandering. Amen. And, and wondering what this world is all about. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I, I saw a program where they say that young people are going to monasteries and joining. Amen. Hallelujah. The order because they, they don't, they're, just, they're desolate. They're, they're wandering. They're nomads. They're just hallelujah. They don't know what this world is all about. And they see, amen, the darkness and other darkness that's in this world and know that darkness has never been the answer. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So they're doing things differently. Some of them, amen. Hallelujah. Doing things different. A lot of turning back to God. Amen. Hallelujah. And giving God their lives because, amen, they've seen that unrighteousness is not the answer. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Darkness is not the answer. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. We have to choose life. We have to choose good. We have to choose God. Hallelujah. And pursue the peace of God. Amen. That surpasses. Amen. Amen. All understanding. Amen. Hallelujah. The best time. Hallelujah. The best time to praise God. Hallelujah. I come to share with you today the best time to praise God. Amen. Not necessarily in the church. We lift our hands in the sanctuary. We sing this song. We lift our hands to give you the glory. Hallelujah. And we'll praise you for the rest of our days. Yes. Hallelujah. That's good. Ain't nothing wrong with coming to God's house and worshiping and praising and magnifying God's name. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. But the best time to give him praise is when you don't know what's going to happen. Hallelujah. You don't know what in the world this thing is. Hallelujah. That's coming up against you. Hallelujah. You know this. You know it's evil. You know it's of the devil, but you just can't break it down and describe it. Just give it over to God. Cast all your cares on him for he care for you. Amen. Go to Psalms 34 and just read it and say, I will bless the Lord. Even in my distress, I cry unto you. Though you slay me, yet will I trust you. All my appointed time shall I wait till my change come. Hallelujah. Give him glory, honor, and praise no matter what. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. No matter what, saints, no matter what believers, give God glory, honor, and praise. The thief come to steal, kill, and destroy. But I am here that you may have life and have it more abundantly. Hallelujah. May you trust God, saints. May you believe on him. May you receive this word today and be blessed in your life today. Hallelujah. By receiving and trusting God, no matter what's going on in your life, trust God and bless his name and magnify him. And baby, never stop praising him. Never stop praising his name. Never stop lifting him up. Hallelujah. God bless you in Jesus name. Amen. Put in your prayer requests. Hallelujah. Praise reports. Hallelujah. Put them all in. Amen. I don't care if you put it in yesterday or last week. Amen. For the same thing you've been saying. Amen. Put that prayer and keep it before the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Keep it before the Lord. Keep it before, before the saints so we can keep praying. Amen. Hallelujah. We're going to keep praying for Minister. Amen. Let for it. Amen. Hallelujah. I'm not let for it. Minister Philip. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Minister Philip. Roscoe Phillips. Amen. Hallelujah. We're going to keep him before the Lord. Amen. He's over there in Jesus. W hospital, but he's also in the hands of the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. And everybody in the hospitals and prison wars and institutions. Hallelujah. Believers believe. I told you, I personally believe that Paul's thorn in his flesh until somebody prove otherwise. Amen. Hallelujah. His thorn in his flesh was believers not believing him having to consistently and constantly defend God, Christ, the gospel to people who are supposed to be believers. Amen. Nothing more frustrating. My God, my friends, I'm trying to tell y'all something. Hallelujah. My number one frustration is ignorance, first of all. Hallelujah. But my second number one, fr my, my second frustration, amen, hallelujah, is, is, is having faith debates with people of faith. 
Hallelujah. <laughs> There's nothing more oxymoronic. Hallelujah. Lord God. Nothing more facetious. Hallelujah. Amen. Lord Jesus. Than having a conversation with somebody who know who Jesus is. Hallelujah. But don't rightly divide the scriptures. Hallelujah. And they have a concept of the freedom and the power that God has given to us. Hallelujah. As believers and the authority that he has given to us as believers. And we are we are boxing up. Hallelujah. We are wrapping up and tape it up. Amen. And put it in the hands of man. Hallelujah. Thank you. Jesus. Knowing that. Amen. What God has can't be put in the box. You will never see it on Amazon. Hallelujah. God, he, they can't put it. It can't be. It can't be Googled. Amen. Hallelujah. There's no search engine that can contain. Hallelujah. God, thank you. The power of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And if we just hold our minds down and we shrink it down to, amen, apostolic, we shrink it down to Baptists and Methodists, and we shrink it down to man's concept of who God is. Hallelujah. Hey, God. And it will never fit. Hallelujah. It will never fit. Hallelujah. Your organization will never fit who God is. Hallelujah. But people of God come together to worship God together. And we create bodies and organizations based on our faith in God. Hallelujah. I have no problem with that. And we come to worship God in meetings and conventions. I have no problem with that. Hallelujah. But baby, your thoughts and your concepts cannot fit. Amen. God. Hallelujah. He's had never fit. Hallelujah. He has never. Jesus. Don't make me go through church history. He's never fit. Hallelujah. In man's box. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. And if we can really just get the concept of the power of the word of God. Hallelujah. And I'll believe in, as he said, Jesus said, believe on me as the scriptures have said. And out of your belly shall flow rivers of living water. And it's time for the believers in Christ Jesus to free themselves. Hallelujah. From the wisdom of man, as Paul said in Corinthians. Hallelujah. And walk in the power of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And get away from man's concept. I'm not saying not to go to church. I'm not saying not to join a church. Hallelujah. But make sure they're preaching Jesus. Hallelujah. Make sure they're preaching Jesus Christ and him crucified. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Why they calling me doing noonday prayer? Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. How they can't know me. If they know me, I'm in, they know I'm in prayer. Hallelujah. God, help us. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Help us, Lord God, to understand it hallelujah let's just understand as, as philip told the ethiopian unit understand with our readers do we really understand what we're reading do we really amen they used to have this thing back in the day riff rif reading is fundamental amen hallelujah amen and, and if we really understood what the word of god is amen how in the beginning was the word john one says and the word was with god the word was god the same in the beginning with god all things that were made by him and was not anything made that was made he made everything that's here hallelujah amen in him was life and the life was the light of men the light shined in darkness and darkness comprehended it not hallelujah the, and the word became flesh and dwelt among us and we beheld his glory the glory of the only begotten of the father full of grace and truth if we really understand and understood what the word of god is to us who believe hallelujah amen paul said for the preaching of the cross to them that perish is foolishness but to us who believe it is the power of god and people say, I want to tap into that power. I want to heal the sick. I want to raise the dead. Why are we not doing that? Because we're not tapping into the power. We're taking a seminar. Jesus, help me. Help me, Jesus. I'm not against seminars, but I'm just saying there's no there's no replacement. There's no substitute for the power of God. There's no substitute for the word of God. Hallelujah. All those are testimony. Commentaries are just testimonies and people's interpretation of the word of the different the different translations of different Bibles are different people's interpretation. Amen. Hallelujah. Of scripture. Amen. Don't let me go into the vulgar in Septuagint and all that. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. They, those are translators. They just translated. Amen. There's a difference between translation and interpretation. 
Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. I'm starting theology class. Hallelujah. Amen. There's a big difference. Amen. And be careful of the interpretations, the interpreters. Amen. There's nothing wrong with I'm, I'm interpreting now. I'm giving y'all scripture. Amen. I thought based on scripture. Hallelujah. That's nothing wrong with preaching. it. Amen. But don't get, amen, translation confused with interpretation. Amen. Hallelujah. Because some people interpret it. Amen. And made that and made that God, law and, and, and gospel. Amen. And, and others just translated the, from Greek. Amen. From from Hebrew to Greek. Amen. The Old Testament, the New Testament was written in Greek because they put it in the, the biggest language of the time. Amen. Y'all got to read the Old Testament. I mean, the New Testament, the original Hebrew. Baby, what is wrong with you? Hallelujah. Amen. It's written in Greek. They wrote Paul wrote it in Greek. Hallelujah. Conine Greek is what they spoke at that time. They spoke many languages. Amen. Hallelujah. I didn't mean to go into all this, but I'm not taking it back. Amen. They they, they spoke Conine Greek. Jesus spoke Conine Greek. Amen. Hallelujah. And so, amen. So they, they, they spoke that language and they wrote the scriptures. Jesus didn't write in the scriptures, but amen. Paul and the disciples, they wrote it in Greek to, to take it into all the world. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Paul wrote those letters in Greek so it could go through all the world. So the Septuagint is Greek. Vulgate is Latin that came later. Amen. When the conquering of Rome. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Vulgate is an interpretation of Septuagint. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Some of those Bibles. Uh, don't leave, let me start it. Don't get me started. Are an interpretation, not a translation. Amen. Hallelujah. And so be careful. Amen. Of a translation and an interpretation. Amen. When you're reading these books, amen. And these, these different, amen, uh, Bibles and things. Amen. Be careful. Make sure it's a, it's a translation. If it's a translation, it's okay. Amen. But if it's an interpretation, that's the one man's thought. It's just like a commentary. Amen. Matthew Henry and all those guys. Amen. Great commentaries. Amen. You can read them. There's nothing wrong with that to get their concept. You might identify with it. You might not. Amen. As the spirit leads you. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. I didn't mean to go to Bible class, but it's all right. Amen. But, but, but hear and understand the word of God. That's basically, that's what the thought is. Amen. And be blessed. Amen. And so when you in the darkest time, the darkest moment of despair, amen, trust God, believe God. Amen. Because all things are working for the good. All things work together for the good for them that love God, them that are called according to his purpose. All right. Amen. Father, we thank you. We praise and magnify. We glorify your holy name. We thank you. Amen. For this day that you have made, we're going to rejoice and be glad in it. Lord Jesus, we will bless your name at all times. We will bless you at all times and, and, and your praise shall continue continually be in our mouth in the best time to give you praise, honor, and glory. Lord God, hallelujah. It's sometimes when we don't know what to do, when we don't know what tomorrow is going to bring. Hallelujah. Now let the weak say, I'm strong. Let the poor say, I'm rich, all because of what you've done. And Lord God, even at our weakest moment, we have strength because we're holding to God's unchanging hand. Hallelujah. In through the midst of the storm, we're holding tighter to you because of the storm. In fair weather, we might not touch your hand at all. Hallelujah. But Lord God, because of the storm, hallelujah, we are holding to you tight, Lord God, hallelujah. And there's a praise that can only come from distress. And there's a praise, God, hallelujah, that can only come from death in the family or sickness or disease. There's a praise that can only come through heartache and headache and pain, hallelujah. And we bless you, hallelujah, Lord God, even when, hallelujah, we don't feel like it, even when, hallelujah, don't seem right to do so. Bless the God, even though through tri trials and tribulation and persecution. Execution. We're still blessing your name and magnify your name because we're holding to your hand because it's coming out of faith. Hallelujah. That praise is coming straight out of faith, not because of what's going on. Hallelujah. Because of who you are and your ability to bring us out. Hallelujah. We praise. Hallelujah. And magnify. Many are the afflictions of the righteous, but God, you deliver us out of them all, Lord God. And so those that are going through stress and distress, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, move, touch, and deliver in your people behalf. Lord God, you know the needs of your people, everybody on this, amen, on this line, Lord God, move right now in the name of Jesus. Make a way out of no way, open doors that seem closed. Move right now, every home, every family, every community that's represented here today, amen, on a podcast, amen, that's going live here on Messenger, amen, whosoever will. 
Lord God, bless, touch, and deliver right now in the name of Jesus, God. Help us to read and study to show ourselves approved unto you. A workman need not be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth. Bless us as your children, Lord God. Hallelujah, Lord God. Help us, Lord God. Hallelujah, to understand and rightly divide your word, Lord God. And that fall for interpretation, Lord God. Hallelujah, Lord Jesus. All these books and seminars and classes that we take, hallelujah, is interpretation, Lord God, of somebody's concept of who you are hallelujah we need to know you god hallelujah without the the view amen without the lens amen that obstruct our views of you god hallelujah lord god through the through the wisdom of man hallelujah lord jesus but help us to see you face to face hallelujah thank you. as moses said i i seek to see you god face to face Hallelujah. You see, you can't look on me and live. Hallelujah. I let you see, amen, what you can see visible. Hallelujah. That's why John said, no man has seen God at any time. Hallelujah, God. We thank you. We praise and magnify your holy name. Hallelujah. Old song said, I want to see Jesus. See him for myself. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord God. We praise and magnify and lift up your holy name. And Lord God, we bless you. Even in, in, in the valley, Lord, we bless you. On the mountain high, we bless you, Lord God, with the same intensity intensity with the same fervor lord god we bless you god hallelujah because that's we are praise praise is what i do and praise is what we do we lift you we magnify you we glorify your holy name heal the sick god hallelujah raise the dead yes even raise the dead hallelujah lord god bless touch and deliver right now in the name of jesus you're able hallelujah to do exceeding abundantly of all, above all that we ask or even think somebody's down to their last dime somebody don't know what tomorrow is going to bring hallelujah we speak the blessings of god that maketh rich and have no sorrow to it open up the windows of heaven and pour your people out on blessing they don't have room to, to receive you know what your people stand in need of you know before we even ask but hear the cry of your people god by reason of their taskmasters for you know their sorrows hallelujah lord god you know what they're going through hallelujah so we speak healing and deliverance satan the blood of jesus is against you right now the lord god rebuke you we cast you out right now in the name of jesus how the spirit of infirmity and sickness and disease hallelujah we cast you out right now in the name of jesus hallelujah we invoke the shekinah glory of god holy ghost have your way hallelujah the paraclete that holy thing hallelujah thank you jesus holy ghost have your way fill the room lord god hallelujah lord god hallelujah as isaiah said when the year the Uzziah died i also saw the lord high and lifted up and his train filled the temple the house was full of smoke and the angels cried holy holy the whole earth is full of his glory lord god fill the room like you did on the day of pentecost when they all spoke the same thing oh god hallelujah lord jesus they began to speak with other tongues as the spirit of god hallelujah gave utterance and the witnesses out there on the street how to say are these not galileans are these not local folk but they're talking hallelujah in my language and giving praise to god hallelujah fill the homes god fill the homes the hospitals the prison wards hallelujah with your glory with your power with your anointing and god most of all these churches hallelujah lord god they're called by your name to say they're called by your name hallelujah fill every home fill every house of worship lord god in the name of jesus with your power your anointing lord god hallelujah as for me and my house we will serve the lord hallelujah bless touch and deliver right now make a way out of nowhere open doors to seem closed god somebody needs your help lord god somebody's being battered and abused somebody got a bottle to their lips a needle to their vein lord god somebody's stuck amen hallelujah they don't have drugs the drugs have them lord god hallelujah we speak deliverance hallelujah we speak deliverance we ha oh god thank you hallelujah hallelujah thank you jesus we speak deliverance hallelujah thank you jesus hallelujah hallelujah many are the afflictions of the righteous but lord you deliver them out of them all hallelujah thank you jesus the righteous cry the lord heareth hallelujah and deliver them out of all their troubles deliver your people god hallelujah right now in the name of jesus how to deliver your people right now hallelujah thank you jesus in the name of jesus whatever it may be hallelujah lord god you shall supply all i need according to your riches and glory bless and we shall be blessed keep us and we shall be kept these and all blessings we ask in jesus christ's name i pray thank you god hallelujah amen 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 and amen god bless you family love you in jesus name Thank God for you being with us today all week long this Friday.
Hallelujah. It's Friday. Amen. When we record this, amen, the end of the week. And we thank God for you being with us. Amen. And we pray that God heal, touch, and deliver you in the name of Jesus and make a way. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Of escape out of whatever that thing is that the devil has set before you. Amen. It will not overtake you because you are the servant of God. Hallelujah. Amen. I am the Lord's. That's what we preached the last broadcast. I am the Lord's. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. He made us as he that has made us and not we ourselves. Amen. We are his people, the sheep of his pastor. We enter his gates with thanksgiving. We enter his courts with praise. How do we bless his name? Amen. For the Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting. His truth endureth through all generations. Some way, somehow, saints and believers get to God's house. Amen. Hallelujah. Get to God's house and worship the Lord in his house. Amen. Yes, he, you can worship him in your house. Amen. He will come right there. Amen. Hallelujah. But the Psalm says, I will, I was glad when they said unto me let us go into the house of the lord make your way amen hallelujah to the house of god sunday amen or whenever y'all worship amen make your way to the house of god and worship the lord in spirit and in truth if you're in the springfield area you're certainly welcome to join us sunday morning hallelujah at 10 o'clock as we get into the word of god as we praise and magnify the name of the lord hallelujah amen hell proof Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hell proof. Amen. Hallelujah. That's what we're going to share with the people of God on Sunday. Amen. In the name of Jesus, you are invited to be here. Amen. If you want a messenger, amen. Come on on messenger. Amen. And we'll be broadcasting right here on this channel. Amen. On Sunday morning. Amen. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus on our new Agape Broadcast Network. Amen. Y'all that have got invitations. Amen. To the uh, Facebook page. Amen. Please answer those petitions. Amen. So at the first of the year, I want to switch over from me to the Agape Broadcast Network, our Facebook page. Right now we're on the Messenger page. Amen. At some point, I want to go live from Amen. Our Facebook page, Agape Broadcast Network. Amen. I've sent out invitations. Some have responded. Some have not. Amen. So we want to fill that page up. Amen. So that when we have at least, amen, 500 on that page, I, I want to go live by the first of the year. Amen. From Agape Broadcast Network. Amen. So those that have not signed on, amen. Those that have not became a member of that group on Facebook, amen. Please do that. Amen. In the name of Jesus, so that, amen, the first of the year we can go live. Amen. Hallelujah. From our new broadcast network. Amen. So God bless you. Have a smile upon you. Love you. In Jesus' name, Friday, share illusions. Amen. Go over there to Del Rey. Amen. Hallelujah. Sister Gales, get your hair did. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of Jesus, and tell her that you heard this broadcast. Amen. Her that we broadcast. Amen. Her business. Amen. On Amen. Agape Broadcast Network. Amen. She's one of our sponsors. She's our main sponsor. Amen. In the name of Jesus, and we thank God for all of you. Amen. Hallelujah. If you're not in the Delray area, Amen. Just give her a call and give her a word of encouragement. Amen. In the name of Jesus, a a black woman. Amen. Business owner. Amen. She's an author. She has a book. Amen. Hallelujah. Maybe you might want to purchase her book. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of Jesus. So, amen. Hallelujah. Just let her know that, that and give her some words of encouragement. We all need encouragement every now and then. Amen. Hallelujah. And all of you that can help Agape be a blessing to this church. Amen. Agape to our, to our, amen. Hallelujah. Our app, our cash app, Agape, C-A-A-G-A-P-E-C-A. -A -A -E amen. Is our identifier. Amen. You can use that amen to give paypal amen or amen hallelujah um you come to the church or mail it to you through the church or check or money order whatever the amount hallelujah amen be consistent amen first of the month first tuesday of every month we want to amen be consistent amen if you if you want to do it monthly if you want to do it weekly amen hallelujah or bi-weekly amen a part of your paycheck amen hallelujah you can do that as well amen or have it automatically deducted a certain amount it could be five dollars 25 whatever the amount may be just be consistent in what you do amen and god will bless you i will bless the lord at all times be consistent amen and god will 
bless you. I promise you that. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. I'm not saying it's going to come through a car or a house. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Or you're going to be adopted by a billionaire. I'm not going to say that. Amen. I'm saying God will bless you when you bless him. Amen. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. God bless you. Have a smile upon you. Have a church home. You're certainly welcome to become part of Agape United in the Springfield area. Amen. You can be part of our online church, our online ministry. Amen. Some people are convalescent. They can't get out. Amen. Hallelujah. Some don't drive, whatever the case may be. Amen. Amen. I want to be a part of Agape Online. Amen. Hallelujah. And you want to give your offerings and your tithes here. Amen. You can do so. And if you don't belong to another church, you can do so. Amen. As well. In the name of Jesus. God bless you. We love you. We thank God for you. Keep us in prayer as we continually pray for you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Our youth program is next Friday. I got anxious. Amen. And I and I said it was this tonight, but it's not the 13th. Amen. Because this is the second. Uh, weekend amen the youth conference on the third weekend but it falls on the fourth sunday it's kind of strange amen but that's all right amen so next next week amen the 20th if i'm not mistaken 7 plus 13 is 20 amen so uh next the 20th of september uh our youth shut-in next friday y'all come on out. i'm getting phone calls from people amen about the shut-in so y'all come on out amen and uh do the shut-in with us on the 20th of september amen the 22nd sunday morning 10 o'clock amen deacon russell amos wright jr will be speaking here at agape amen hallelujah that sunday morning at 10 so y'all come on out amen and hear this young man come speak Amen. Here at Agape in Jesus name. Amen. God bless you. Love you in Jesus name. I close in scripture. First Timothy, first chapter 17 verse. Now to the king, eternal, immortal, invisible, the only wise God be honor and glory forever and ever. Let the church say, amen. Hug somebody. Tell them that you love them. This is the Agape way. God bless you, family. Love you in Jesus name. And I'll see you guys next time. God bless you. Agape Worldwide Ministries and Pastor Renzo James Fields invite you to come worship with us in Springfield, Virginia. We're located 7240 FNG Budenite Drive in Springfield, Virginia. Call 703-372-1174. Agape Worldwide Ministries. Real love, real people, real church.